Today in this video, let's learn about different type of primary and secondary batteries, where we will cover its definition, usage, history and different types. If you guys haven't seen the previous video about battery, go check it out. The link appears up here and it's even in the description too. So let's get started. Primary batteries are those which we see every day and use them. These batteries come in a cylindrical configuration and a simple and a convenient source of power for several portable electronic and electrical devices like cameras, watches, toys, radios and many more. Usually primary batteries are inexpensive, lightweight, small and very convenient to use with very less or no maintenance. Up until 1970s, the zinc anode based batteries were the predominant primary batteries. Later, zinc carbon batteries were invented. The most significant development in the battery technology took place during 1970s to 1990s period. It was during this time, the famous zinc alkaline manganese dioxide batteries were developed and slowly replaced the older zinc carbon types. Okay, I'll make it easy for you guys. These are the 9 mode batteries which we see and use in many electronic applications. Mostly they are constructed of 6 individual 1.5 volt cells enclosed in a wrapper where zinc is a anode and manganese is a cathode. To keep it short and simple, these are the rechargeable batteries. These batteries can be used in two ways. One, they are used as energy storage devices where they are electrically connected to the main energy source to be charged by it and also supplying energy when required. Best example can be hybrid electric vehicles, uninterrupted power supplies and many. Two is where the battery is used and discharged as primary battery. Once it is completely discharged, instead of throwing it away, we recharge it with an appropriate charger. Best examples are our mobile phones, laptops, electric vehicles, power tools and many. The oldest and the first type of secondary batteries were the lead acid batteries which were developed in the late 1850s. These were the most commonly used batteries which dominate till date as we see in our automobile industry. These lead acid batteries are based on lead dioxide electrochemical couple and sulfuric acid as the electrolyte. The second type of rechargeable batteries are the nickel cadmium batteries. These batteries were developed in the early 1900s where nickel oxyhydroxide is a positive electrode and cadmium metal based as a negative electrode and the electrolyte is an alkaline solution of potassium hydroxide. Then the game changer stepped in and it's our very own lithium batteries which were proposed by British chemist M. Stanley Whittingham in 1970s. Even nickel metal hydride batteries were used as secondary batteries, but lithium ion is the game and is still the boss in the market. I know there is a lot to absorb. Refer to the website where you can find the detailed notes about the topics. The link is in the description. Go check it out. If you find this video helpful, do hit the like button. To learn more about EVs, go subscribe to my channel where I'll be posting videos consistently. Check out the website given in the description where you can upload blogs, resolve your queries and can also watch our previous videos with a clear and detailed explanation. There is a community page completely dedicated for EV enthusiasts around the globe. In the upcoming video, we shall learn about lithium batteries and its types. Thank you for watching. Happy learning.